team coverage continues now with CBS 4's Tiani Jones, who is also live in Southwest Miami Dade. And Tiani, you're following the latest on the massive search. What is that? That's right, and it is a huge search. Just take a look at behind me at the large scale of what they have going on. Police have actually set up a perimeter in this area, and we're in the area right now of Southwest 122nd Court and Southwest 248th Street. You can see the SWAT vehicles over there. Now, we have video from earlier. Miami-Dade police have had dogs out, SWAT vehicles, and dozens of units in the area. As we were trying to get to this area, we found that the Miami-Dade police have also blocked off a lot of neighborhood streets. Police in SWAT gear have pretty much swarmed this area. They're also searching by helicopter. We've seen that helicopter going up in the air and landing several times. Now, here's what we've been able to learn from police. This all began with a shooting that turned into a chase. In the process of this chase, police took a woman into custody who was in the car. Another suspect was found nearby, and the search continues for the driver in this particular area where we're at right now. The suspects are all believed to be involved in that drive-by shooting. We spoke with police earlier, and they gave us more details about what's going on. We are still actively looking with our special response team for the possible driver of that vehicle. The um, conditions and obviously what we do want to get across is, is that this this area the perimeter which is between 250 street 248 street and 254 street 123 avenue to 129 avenue that air that grid there is where we're doing the perimeter we're asking residents to, re, to to remain away from that area because obviously this individual is considered armed and dangerous Again, that perimeter is in the area of Southwest 248th Street to 254th Street and Southwest 120th Avenue to the canal in this area. But again, you can see the large scale that they have, that this search that they have going on here. We have the SWAT units out. We've seen police coming and going. And again, a lot of the neighborhood streets in this area have been blocked off while police search this area. We're going to continue to bring you updates about what's going on out here. But again, if you're in this area and you notice the police, and some roads blocked off. That's what's going on. Reporting live, Tiani Jones, CBS 4 News. Tiani, thank you for that. And we will continue to follow this developing story for you. Look for the latest all day on CBSMiami.com and on CBS 4 News at 5.